You happy, Nika? I'm happy. Yeehaw. Welcome to a very beautiful South Caicos Island. You remember in last week's video, I said that we had a bit of a problem with the idea of crossing Cuban airspace. Well, it's not a problem anymore because we've decided not to cross Cuban airspace. Do you want it a little lower? How do you... Uh, yeah, so you... Yeah, I can just... If you twist that one... Yeah, yeah, I got it. You got it. You see, Cuba has got this huge area surrounding it called an ADZ, or I think it's an air defense zone. It's got an inner zone and an outer zone. And to pass through either of those, you need a clearance. And to pass through the inner one, you actually need a permit. And because we know we can't get through that, and because we know that going around it, we actually thought about going to Jamaica at one point, refueling there and going on. It's just not possible with the amount of time we have left on this trip. So we're gonna stay north of that ADZ and start making our way slowly back to Florida today. Yeah, let me do all that. You do all so that. You, okay. you, you can just focus on uh, your brakes are yours. All right, brakes are mine. Okay. What that means is hopefully we'll be back in America by the end of today. But in order to do that, we've got a long day of flying ahead of us. And that's why I'm up really early this morning so we can get something to eat, get to the airport, get the aircraft pre flighted, and go. South Caicos information, Sierra's November 122 Sierra Zulu is taxiing on taxiway Alpha for a departure runway 11. Uh, to Provost VFR. Oh, I almost said Echo Yankee earlier, Dave. You did? I almost did. <laughs> Thanks, Joe. Yep. There you go. You happy, Nika? I'm happy. There she goes. She just took off. She likes you. <laughs> and I like her too. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Wow. So, departed South Caicos now, about a third of the way to our first stop. It's only, what have we got, 30 miles, 10 minutes until we get there. Um, this is a really important part of aviation. You're never going to always get your plan A. Like, we really wanted to go to the Cayman Islands, right? We had accommodation booked, we really wanted to go there. But it just was becoming too complicated. We were just trying to squeeze too much into one plan. The moment it starts getting too hard, my opinion, and I love flying with Nico because I think he's similar to me, my opinion is it was too hard just to throw it away. And that's really what we've done today. I almost don't care what the destination is as long as the flight itself is going to be able to be executed safely and enjoyably. And we will be saying, wow, many, many times on this trip. Wow, wow look. <laughs> I really want to see some sharks. Runway in use one zero. Transition level eight zero. Surface wind, one zero zero degrees. Zero six knots. Two six decimal zero on initial contact. Remember one two two Sierra Zulu, we are one nine miles from Provo. Roger. Roger. Uh, let's, uh one second, show Nico. Yep. And remember 122 Sierra Zulu, 10 miles Provost. Roger. Report midfield, right downwind. We'll report midfield, uh, right downwind. We'll, uh, we'll go. Remember 122 Sierra Zulu. Oh, cool. Echo Yankee Zulu. Nice. Right. Awesome. Great job, man. Thank I'll you. Pull back your mixture a little bit. I landed on the wrong wheel, but. Okay, first stop, Provost. Once again, we were here just this time yesterday, but back here at the airport, refuel, have a bit of a pit stop for us and then the long flight. Can we get a lift to there? Yeah, sure. Just for my video. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a long walk, you know, it's been a long couple of days of flying and there's been, oh no, wait, we're actually here now. Uh, Sorry, we're here. It's 50 feet. Thank, Thank you, so you're much. the man, appreciate that. November 122 two, Sierra Zulu, maintain runway heading up to departure wind 120 degrees, zero, 8 knots, runway one, zero, clear for takeoff. Runway 10 clear for takeoff, runway heading 120, thanks. And uh, here she goes. She's full of fuel now, you can tell, right? Yeah, slower to get off. Oh, yeah. 600. 122 two, Sierra Zulu, airborne 15, report passing 4,000 feet. Report passing 4,000 feet, 120. There's some real IMC, buddy. It was... Yay! 122 Sierra Zulu, passing altitude? 3,700 uh, for 6,000, 126. Contact Miami Center, 125 decimal 1. 125 decimal 1, to Sierra Zulu, I'm trying to touch your nostrils. Yuck! I wouldn't if I was you. Gross. Uh, sweet, sweet oxygen. Yep, I have it. Well, I don't because I'm not plugged in. <laughs> and over 122 Sierra Zulu, when able to proceed direct decal. I maintain flight level 140. I fly level uh, 140 and direct decal to Cheshire. Code by calling the FXC facility before departing. American. 
that's better. Two Sierra Zillow, you trying to go? Uh, affirmative, yeah. I'd like about 10 to the right, if at all possible. Two Sierra Zillow, Roger. DV to the right, of course, approved. When able, rejoin Amber 555 and advise. All right, well, when able, back to uh, Amber 555 and advise. It looks like through this dark a bit, we should be able to see yeah, yeah, through so. that. I think so. Things will be fine. And then we can make a decision after that point. Yeah. So slow. So slow. We've been tracking this. We've been tracking this cloud, this sort of storm system on our left for probably about half an hour, 40 minutes. Oh yeah, just going alongside. So Nico's been flying us around the edge of it, diverting. The hope is around the edge of this, we'll be able to get back on track and head back towards Florida again. Right. There's so definitely a build up just close to uh, Fort Lauderdale too. Yeah. 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 Yeah, at this altitude, I'm not going to be able to see through all these build-ups here. I think we're going to have to descend line, uh, down to like 10,000. November 2 zero Zulu, just to maintain 1-0-10,000. One 10,000, zero, 10, thanks to Jezero. What about through there? It's just I can see all the way through to the other side. Yep. Yep, I think we can do this. That was a good call, man. Thank you. November 1 2 2 zero, Zulu, Miami Center of the Mata 2 Extreme Precipitation, 1 o'clock, lasting 3-5 miles to the northwest. Oh. Amazing. Uh, Such energy in there. Here's two, Sierra County Executive Tower, 120.9. Over to the tower, thanks for your help. The Shazer look great service. There's Pompano. Wow. <laughs> the moment you turn it off. Wow. Oh my god. That's two miles away, that lightning strike. This is a quick tour of the Banyan FBO. That's like a fixed based operator. It's like a lounge for private pilots here at the Fort Lauderdale Airport. If you run out of supplies or clothing for your baby, you can find them here. There's also fish. A selection of aeroplanes. Nico. <laughs> Tables that are made out of disused engine parts. A very cool place to come and relax after a long flight. Okay, so we're going to Key West. We're going to Key West. Yeah. What's this landing? Let's play guess the aircraft. Uh, citation jet. No. Oh, you're so good. No, I don't know. I just said that. Ten points Aren't in the November, comments if you know what this is. Here, Zulu traffic under downwind. A Cirrus only niner. Line up and wait. And she's like jumping. She's like I'm out. Boing. Like a kangaroo. Yeah. You got an Aussie on board. <laughs> Six hundred. And Arthur has little permission to uh, proceed the southeast bound outside of the Charlie. November 122, Sierra Zulu approved as requested, contact for Lauderdale 119.3. Over to uh, Fort Lauderdale International Tower, thanks. Whee! Whee! Look at the closer. Boats. Let's go closer to the shoreline. Yeah, so not above 500 down here, because you've got what, Class Charlie above Caution, you? Caution, obstacle. Yeah. Caution, uh, obstacle. Inhibit. The port of Lauderdale. Yeah. Yeah. There's a lot of the cruises live from here. From uh, Look at all the people on the beach. For, uh, this is Miami Isles. Okay, lots of hotels yeah. here, lots of uh, parasols yeah. on the beach. Hallandale Beach. Oh, this is so nice, like low down yeah. by the coast, isn't it? Miami Beach is uh, over here. This is Miami Beach, all of it. Uh, this is South Beach, starts right here. Yeah, that's where we stayed, I yeah. recognize that. That's very cool to see Miami like that, low yeah. level along the coastline. I've done some flying up the Gold Coast in Australia, that's the only thing I can equate it, almost below the heights of the buildings along the beach. Right. but. Wow. I never realized Miami actually spread out that far. There's a lot more to it. You just think of Miami Beach. No, no, it's uh, Miami's a big town. Yeah. Yeah, 
Yes, and when I think of Florida Keys, this is kind of this view is what you think of, isn't it? It's yeah. the the bridge, the, like the movies that have been shot down here. I'll show you well. the seven mile bridge. Oh, this isn't the long this isn't bridge. So this is the baby one. Yep. Ah, uh, is this it? This is it. Yeah. Okay, I will say this does look a lot longer than the other ones that we saw. Oh before. yeah. Bloody hell. Definitely seven miles. It's definitely seven miles. Good, good, all set. Ooh, birds. Birds? Yeah. Brickyard, 3476, you can start your back taxi for following. Cirrus 220 Zulu, turn right on Alpha 3, right on Alpha, Bravo 6, into the ramp. Good job, eh? Welcome to Key West, buddy. You said something about Key Lime Pie? Brickyard, 3476, sure turn right. Come to Key West, they said. It's paradise, they said. Today, we've decided to fly into the biggest airport in the southeast of the United States. Hey, farewell. Okay, man,